Well, it looks like we're going back to some more Dying Light 2, and my god, man, was the experience really fun? Oh, 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 oh I didn't know I could do this. Oh, oh my god, man, I freaking pissed me up. up, up. And well, the whole experience on this whole event has been really good, and obviously for today's video, we are playing this new event called... That's right, everybody. We are playing a new alteration for today's video, which is called WrestleManiac. And my god, mate, this event makes you go absolutely insane with the fists. I'm not even joking. But at the same time, the fists were completely useless on this game. But now, Teclan are like, you know what, guys? To make this game more fun, let's just go and get your fists and have a good time. So it reminds me of, like, playing Merc Music or something when he says, Miss me, daddy! Woo! So, yeah, that's been great. But anyways, everybody, I'll shut up and let's continue off with the campaign and the new event. So anyways, let's get into the video. You know what? The more I look at this amazing beginning of Dying Light 2 is actually pretty damn good. Okay, I'll shut up. Ah, oh. There we go. Alteration WrestleManiac. Can you smell what we've been cooking? Yeah, not releasing DLC 2. <laughs> go out into the streets and put your punches and kicks to the test as they have been made even more powerful. How powerful? Well, we'll see for yourself. <laughs> Thanks, game. You definitely know what we're doing for today's video. What's up, guys? My name's Jonathan and welcome back to some more Dying Light 2. I'm sorry I haven't been uploading any Dying Light 2 videos lately because I'm not been playing as much Dying Light 2 compared to when I was uploading videos all the time. So instead I've been playing a lot more Call of Duty, so if you guys want to check out those videos, you can. But like what I said earlier, for today's video, we're just going to test out the new alteration and see how it is. Because the last one I did, I believe, was the Firearms one, I think? I'm not too sure. But anyways, before we get into it, I know you guys love the Dying Light 2 content, so if you guys want to support me, make sure you subscribe because we're on the road to 2,000 subscribers. And hey, let me know your ideas down in the comments down below for the future content on my channel. But besides that, let me go and get myself a drink and let's continue off where we last went playing it. Oh boy. <laughs> and the more I think about it, this game is doing really well. Even though a lot of people are complaining about it, even though most people that did watch my video are getting really annoyed at me, but you know what? I don't know anymore. Oh yeah, let's do it. Okay, so we're gonna go through the journey of the quests again because this is actually something to do in the game because there's not really a lot to do once you complete everything. So when you go into a new game plus and do this, it's actually something different, so I can't complain. Uh, Bring the blood to Andy. You know what? Let's do that. Okay, so let's go and test out this new alteration, whatever the heck it is. <laughs> what is wrong with me? Yeah, I'm doing this shit with you. I freaking love dying like two. Okay, so... Uh, so as you can see here, Jonathan has no idea how to unequip his weapon, even though he's been playing dying like two for the past two years. Yeah, thanks, John. Okay, so I've got the weapons here. Okay, hang on. How do I bring my fist out? Oh my god. You know what? I have no idea how this almost took me two minutes to find out how to unequip a freaking weapon, but yeah, that's my luck. Mm. All right, I'm gonna freaking punch all you motherfuckers. Oh my god, those zombies look so detailed now. What the heck? Anyways, let's see how this is. Oh, but, oh, but. Oh, 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 okay. So it's, you know what? It's like a freaking obvious. It's just bloody whack-a-mole season, but with a fist. <laughs> Give me up. Oh, you're stupid about whack-a-mole. <laughs> oh, you. you know why? Every time I'm dying, like, sorry, Techland, add these kind of events in, the game's actually just really fun to play. So you don't have to worry about all the other things in the game. Just sit here and you go, what the heck am I doing? That's definitely a dead body. Give me up. Oh, you're oh, you're <laughs> oh. oh, hang on. Why does I just hold it down? Oh, f yeah. Man, you would really think that Aiden can do this after so many years of killing freaking zombies. Hey, you know what? I'll just go with the storyline. How about that? Yeah. <gasps> Come here, you. <laughs> you. Oh my god. This sh is so broken. Oh, uh, yeah. Before I forget, I wanted to say thank you for the love and support on my Dying Light 1 video because, man, it seems to be that Dying Light 1's getting a lot more players on lately because I think it was free the other day. Not the other day, like a while ago. I can definitely tell a lot more people are more excited about with, well, freaking Dying Light 1 and number 2 because when you do compare number 1 and 2, number 1. One is far better than what number two is. I like what I always say, everyone is different on what they like, don't like in the game. But if I was going to personally vote down on which one's better, I would definitely say number one is better. But number two is getting there. It's just taking a lot longer for it to match up to what number one is. But because of the countless videos I've already made on Dying Light 2, or why you should play Dying Light 2 in 2024, and all the other information that I was trying to say, yeah, there's a lot of things you can still do in Dying Light 2, but at the end of the day, this is wait for what Techland's going to release in the near future. So I have seen seen comments of people talking about you need to write a script properly and go more in detail on your videos which i understand where most people are coming from
something fun, don't get me wrong. It's a learning process that I've tried to do every day when I'm editing videos, making videos. And at the same time, I'm like, I'm a cut commentary channel. I don't really want to do like a whole script unless it's like a project of mine. But don't get me wrong, I understand where most people are coming from, God. But definitely when DLC 2 and that come out, I'll definitely will be doing my own actual proper review on Dying Light 2. When the game's like, that's it, that's it's a no more. At the moment, it's like, eh, whatever. And that face still, okay, let's do it. But there's so many other YouTubers out there that make good videos on Dying Light. So if you guys want to check them out, I've got some recommended videos that you can watch. But don't worry, down the track, I'll bring out my video on that like, in depth properly. But for the time being, these are only cut commentary videos and just me having fun playing video games. And I know so many of you love the Dying Light content. But like what I said on my previous videos, I'm not giving up on Dying Light. Sorry, like Dying Light 1 and 2. I'm not going to be uploading so much of it, if that makes any sense. I definitely will be uploading another Dying Light 1 video when I feel like playing Dying Light 1 because I just don't want to play a video game and upload videos I don't really want to upload. Like I want to enjoy the videos I'm making and also playing as well. God damn. Sometimes I understand that a lot of people do get put off by cut commentary videos or me just mucking around. But it's really up to all of you. So you don't have to watch my content. But if you are watching my content, I really appreciate every single one of you that are watching my content. <laughs> <laughs> so once again, we've got a lot of content on the way, like, mate. We've got the new Star Wars game coming out this month. We also got this Dustborn, or whatever it's called. I don't I forgot what it was called. Hang on. We also got Black Ops 6 beta videos planned. So, mate, there's a lot more that I'm going to be uploading on my channel. I really hope that most of you are going to be watching that. Especially you. Yes, you. <gasps> Fuck it. Okay, so where am I supposed to... Oh, my God. Don't tell me I'm going to do... Oh, was I doing this last time? You know what? I don't care. Okay, hey, man. How's it going? My name is Jonathan. I'm going to sit here and drink my bloody mineral water because I don't know what I'm doing with my fucking life, okay? Oh, okay, let's do it. I'm gonna come here. Oh, hang on. <laughs> Okay, 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 okay. This is for my freaking D minus or freaking dying light. Why does this game look so good, man? God damn, this game is getting better and better every time I go back to it. I remember when the game first came out. Don't get me wrong, the game was still good, but not really what people were expecting. But playing it now, it's like me. <laughs> you come here. Ooh. Oh, 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 oh. That face, no. <laughs> Everyone has a. Hey, man, how's it going? I hope you're having a wonderful day and night. But god damn, come here. <laughs> Oh, shit. No wonder why Techland wants me to join the bloody creative program. You'll be coming around the mountain. Uh, it makes me wonder about the future of Dying Light 2, man. Like, I know I'm thinking, like, I play radio half the time, but goddamn, I just want more content. I know we've got the content. That's why I've been playing other games lately. Okay, I'm skipping this. I don't want to do this. It really feels like the less I play this game and go back to it after a while, I just love it more and more. Especially when I went back to Dying Light 1, I was very surprised of how well the game is still holding up after, like, nine years, I believe. Like, it's so clever on how you play an old video game and all of a sudden it's much more better than the newer games that come out now. I don't know how that makes any sense, but it just does in 2024 gaming. And, I mean, seeing the peak of Dying Light 1, I mean, like, fucking hell, like, jeez, goddamn, dude. Oh, wait, was I here earlier on the freaking Tower Raid? I forgot the Tower Raid mode even existed. Hey, this mode's pretty interesting, I'm not gonna lie. I wonder what other alteration they're gonna be adding into this game. It'd be cool if they had, like, moon boots or whatever it was, so you can jump two times higher. You know how funny that would be if they had those like x-men laser eyes or whatever they're called yeah definitely a lot of people are gonna go nah i don't want that in this game it's gonna be too shit i'm just like it's just a video game it doesn't have to be all serious well to make it serious let's kill these fee zombies oh that's definitely the whole entire event. Instead of using overpowered weapons, all you gotta do is just use your fist. Just like when people go, fist me daddy. <laughs> oh, sh yeah. Oh, the f the up up up. Man, whoever thought that if we all had fists like this in real life, we would be A-OK. -okay. That's definitely not going to happen anytime soon, you know. Hold on, what are you doing? Dude, that's like one of the best animations right there. It's a graffiti and a tech clean. You might have to look onto that, mate. Breaking news. Oh, what the f- I didn't do anything wrong. What the f- I didn't do anything. Okay, f*** it. Come here. I got my two fists. Fire, fire. Oh shit, that's fucking broken! Oh, it is broken when it's, they actually made it better. That zombie doll, look at that. Oh, help me. Like how I killed those three PKers and all of a sudden I've got to go to the PK place. It's like friendly fire. Oh, don't worry about it. Oh my god, shut up about bloody skull phase. I already killed him already. God. I still can't believe I bought the ultimate edition for that bloody mode and all of a sudden they're like, yeah, everyone gets the... What's it called again? For free? We'll be here. Jesus Christ, kid. Play like, freaking Legend of Zelda right there. Yeah, ooh, hey, dude. <laughs> Yeah, anyway, where, am, where, where oh, hi. This wasn't even worth showing. Oh, don't tell me I'm gonna go all the way back to freaking Driscoll. Oh, good timing. At least I killed those PKs. Now I can kill the bloody renegades, if that's what they're called. Anyway, hey guys. 
what the f did I just do? Come here, 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 come Hang on, what would happen if I could kill a volatile with this? That gives me an idea. No, oh, oh, yeah. What the hell is that? Okay, it's finally night time. So let's test out this actual popper mode on a volatile with a two fist. This might be the biggest mistake of my life. Hey, buddy, come here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, five, ten. Uh, yeah, ten. Ten or eleven punctures. It's actually possible. I can I hate all of you. Fuck you. Fuck you, bitch. Fuck you. Come on. Come on. You don't know who I am. My name's Garvin. Come here. Fist up your ass. Fist it. Fist it. Fist it. Thank, Thank you. you. Well, at least you know it's actually possible to actually fist people. I should stop saying that. <laughs> so you're watching this right now before the boat ends. Yep, yeah, takes about ten to eleven punctures. Punctures, kill a volatile. That is fing actually pretty damn broken, you tell me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, about ten. Yeah, ten or eleven. Hey, that's fing sexy. This is about a. <laughs> I can hear myself. Thank you. Come on. Shit, shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's freaking out uh, the, uh, the buckable season. But I haven't felt like this since freaking graduation. Oh, How the does that make any sense? Fucking hell, this is so freaking good, man. I freaking love this game. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> I'm not being a bitch right now. I just want to test how the fists are. Uh huh. You can't get me. You think you can get me? You can't get me. <laughs> Come on, get out of here. Yeah. Do this all day and night, you know. You don't know who I am. Wow, that actually was really fun. What the heck? So at least you now know you can uh, go absolutely wild at night time. Even though that wouldn't make any sense in the storyline, but you know what? Who cares? It's playable. <laughs> anyway, where were we? Yeah. Uh -huh. Ooh, man, welcome to play Mike Tyson boxing game. I like how the easiest way to move around the map is just slide jump. Look at that. Slide jump, slide jump, slide jump. And there's people out there who are already level maxed. I'm sitting here like, how the f*** are you guys already level maxed? And of course, Jonathan decided to go and do the puncturing on a GRE anomaly. So yeah, that was great. I hope you have a wonderful day. You're not going to kill me. I've killed you so many goddamn times. Oh, hang on. What am I using a weapon? I'm using my fist. Killing a bloody GRE anomaly is actually working for a this. I remember when these things used to be so goddamn hard to kill. <laughs> You're almost there. Don't you run away from me. Come here. Come on. Come on. You're almost there. Almost there. Almost there. Almost there. Thank you. God. Oh, oh shit. There's so many zombies. Okay, well, good old freaking fashion. Let's make this as fast as we can do it. <laughs> Just like that. Open it, you bitch. Open it. Open it. Open it. I swear to God, I feel like I got to play ADHD or something. A damn hard dick. Oh, fuck. Oh, what the f*** did I just do? Oh, no. I didn't do that. I like the f***ing win because I am the win. Oh, fuck. Wow, this game's actually way too easy now. What the heck am I doing? So I just ran away from these bastards and they're going to come around and try to get me again. People complain about nighttime and it's like, have you never played Dawn Light 1 before? Good work, hotshot. What did you think? Yeah, amazing. I think infested people and uh, killed zombies. Yeah, it's great. Yeah, we did it, boy. Okay, how to make this more interesting before we can send this video off with a bang. No! Everybody, suck it here. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Die. Fuck ball season. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Well, everybody, that is going to be the video for today. And yeah, the alteration for the WrestleManiac is actually really fun to play. But it's not like something like, wow, no way. It's only a little side event that you can actually have fun playing. And overall, if you're watching this video right now, it might still be out. I'm not too sure. But hey, if you want to have some fun, I can't say why not. But just remember, everybody, we still have more Dying Light content on the way. So don't worry about that. But anyways, everybody, I hope you guys have a wonderful day and night. Take care of yourself. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Oh, no. It's a bad idea. Bad idea. <laughs> ah!